James Tello Jr. writes, Hello, Collider crew. I'm a huge fan of the show and have watched it every day for the past three years. Thanks, James. So my question has to do with the new Uncharted movie. It was announced, I believe, early last year that an Uncharted movie is coming on June 30th, 2017, but there has been no word of the movie since, not even casting for the main character, Nathan Drake. What's happening? Have you guys heard any updates? And if not, do you think it will make the 2017 release date? Um, I'm starting to wonder if it'll hit the 2017 release date. Now, from what we know, um, uh, Seth Gordon is attached to direct. I like Seth Gordon actually quite a bit. I think he's a really interesting name to be attached, but he's been attached to direct this for a while. I really expected that we were going to hear a name for Drake like Mm -hmm. five months ago. I thought we were. So... Everybody I talk to says, oh, yeah, it's still going, it's still going, but we're seeing nothing happen. This is a video game. Part of me wonders, because we've been talking for a long time about how, look, everybody's going to be watching to see what happens with Warcraft and Assassin's Creed, Mm -hmm. because these could be the two most important films ever in the history of the video game genre of movies, right? Because if these two games are good, or these two films are good, and they work, you're going to see a whole new golden age of video game movies coming out. Maybe there's something at play here where maybe they're stepping back saying, whoa, 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 let's wait and see what happens with Warcraft. Let's wait and see what happens with Assassin's Creed. I don't know. Tomorrow they could announce who Drake is, and that would be totally cool. But anyway, have you heard anything about this? Where do you think it's going? No, I mean, you've heard so many different things. At, at one point, uh, David O. Russell and then Mark Wahlberg were attached, and then that, that fell through. And then, like you said, Seth Gordon. Um, I think that you're absolutely right. I think that once we hear about Warcraft and see how Warcraft does, and any, if Warcraft doesn't do well, they'll still wait to see how Assassin's Creed does. But to me, out of all all those movies, Assassin's Creed, which I'm very excited about, even a little bit more so than Warcraft, I think that Uncharted is the one that should have a movie. It, mm-hmm. it, I mean, the dude is in, he's got an Indiana Jones totally. with even more of a, a, a quick wit. Um, I think that if Chris Pratt wasn't so overused, he'd be perfect for for Drake. He would be good. He'd be perfect. It's just the fact that he's just he's casting everything right, right now. So, but I just think that you will hear, especially if those movies do well. But I still think even those if those movies bomb. There's, and I don't think they will, but even if they do, I think that this movie's gonna get made because it's it's ready for a movie adaptation. Totally is, Schnapp. Yeah, I, you know, a lot of other companies, a lot of video game companies are readying themselves and preparing a bunch of other movie adaptations. I think they're gonna pull the trigger on a ton more, even if Warcraft fails, and even if Assassin's Creed fails, I think you're gonna see a lot of announcements coming out in the next six months for five or six movies, like we're doing this, we're doing that. And and I think they're gonna try to run right into the heels of Assassin's Creed. So even if somehow both of those films are box office bombs, which I don't don't think both of them will be, one of them should be a hit. I don't know which one, but they're gonna announce a lot of these other ones. We've been waiting for like Tom Hardy, Splinter Cell, and all these other movies forever. But I think you're gonna hear a lot of announcements. I've been hearing a lot of buzz from all the different video game companies. They're they're manning up. They're getting they're getting some big talent. So believe me when I say they're you're gonna hear some crazy announcements in the next few months for video game adaptations as feature films because the video game market is massive. It's giant. It makes more money than all of movies, television, and music combined. Video games just absorbs that. It makes it it's like I ate it for breakfast. Sorry, I make too much money. That's what video games are about. So. We're going to hear it about Uncharted, and I think they can make their 2017 date. Just look at Assassin's Creed. They just wrapped filming. That's right. going to be coming out. And they were like, hey, they haven't even started shooting it. And they're like, yeah, we just wrapped, son. So it's like once they announce who they got, maybe it'll be a Bradley Cooper. Who knows who they're going to get for Uncharted. Once they get it, they're going to rock it out. They're going to make it happen. So Yeah, as of right now, I'm not even sure if Seth Gordon is still attached okay. uh, to direct. I know he was at one point. I thought he did a great job in the original Horrible Bosses. I even kind of liked Identity Thief a bit, but if you have not seen his documentary, uh, King of Kong, Fistful of Quarters, Mm -hmm. it is one of my favorite documentaries like of the last 10 years. It's so, for something so unimportant, you get so emotionally invested in it. It's unbelievable. Bruce (laughs) Weeby. Get over, check that film out if you get a chance, uh, just as fast as you can. Hey guys, if you like this clip, click here to watch the entire episode. Also, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel because it'll help you stay up to date with all the stuff we've got going on here at Collider.